I grew up in a town called Upland, California. My father and mother immigrated here from Iran in the 80s. And my father first got a job as a carpet technician and my mother as a nurse. The path to becoming an attorney was actually an interesting one. You know, my first job at 17 was working as a cook in a restaurant. Then I got a job as a cashier in a gas station and I moved on to waiting tables at a cafe. Early on, I dreamed of going to law school for one purpose only, and that was to become a trial lawyer. No one in my family was an attorney, and I had no idea where to start. Truly, at that time, I was lost. When the opportunity finally presented itself, I moved across the entire country and took out 140 k in student loans to attend law school. When I got out of law school, I moved across the country again back to California, passed the bar exam, and I started applying to jobs. It was a hard time for me. I had no connections in the legal industry, but I just kept grinding, sending applications as fast as I could to as many people as I could. And I wasn't getting good feedback at the time. But I decided, you know what? I'm gonna start writing personal letters to trial attorneys across the entire state. And maybe one of them will be kind enough to give me a shot. After multiple rejections, I decided to personally write a note to Trish Law, who at the time had done over 90 jury trials. And she read my letter and gave me a text back, and I still have that letter today. I was hired on that job for an initial salary of $6,750 a month. It was a really low salary at the time for being an attorney, but I took it because I knew the experience I was about to gain would change my life forever. After Trish Law gave me the opportunity to start, it was off to the races. Within my first year, I had brought in over 100 cases, tried multiple cases in a courtroom, and settled millions. The beauty of being a trial lawyer is that I get to be the voice for people who are voiceless. What I believe is one of my strengths is my ability to connect with jurors and relate to them through my own life experiences. And I think that's very valuable. I feel like a lot of lawyers are disconnected with the reality that people experience because they've never gone through the struggles that the majority of Americans face every single day. The truth of the matter is the attorneys and the billion dollar corporations that are defending their cases against my clients always see my clients as just another number. During a trial, it's my job to communicate my client's story to the jury, and I'll even tell the jury that this is their moment to do the right thing. A lot of my clients are seriously hurt. They've had surgeries, amputations, serious burns, or have even passed away in some cases. And a jury trial is their last chance to be compensated for what was taken away from them in the way of health. This is what I was made to do, and I'm truly grateful for it. I'm a trial lawyer for the people, and only for the people.